Revelation 14, 6, And I saw another angel fly in the midst of heaven, having the everlasting gospel to preach unto them who dwell on the earth, and to every nation, and kindred, and tongue, and people, saying with a loud voice, Fear God, and give glory to him, for the hour of his judgment is come, and worship him that made heaven, and the earth, and the sea, and the fountains of the waters. somebody and getting high all the time and God starts cleaning you up. Tiny Lister and Felicia Lister. And Jesus is the answer with Pastor Ernest Johnson. This is Pastor Ernest Johnson. And amen. For Jesus is the answer today, we have the two divas of gospel, Mary Mary. We just want to, you know, shake up the world, let everybody know that Jesus lives, Jesus is real, and we come to step on the devil's feet in these high heels. Amen. Hey, y'all, this is Mary Mary, and you're watching Jesus is the answer with Pastor Ernest Johnson. She's finished. Praise the Lord. This is Bishop Ernest Johnson, and today this is a special broadcast of Jesus is the Answer. It's going to be Thanksgiving in about a week, and so we're doing our part, small part, but, it, uh, but everything starts, and the Bible says despise not small beginnings. Even though it's small, amen, we're giving out about 100 fully cooked dinners today to the homeless, and around the areas of Compton, California. And that vision was given to these great, wonderful people of God who are members of the Jesus is the Answer Church. I want you guys to introduce yourselves to our audience real quick. Hi, my name is Minister Cherie, and this is really a blessing to pass out this food to the homeless. And, you know, any one of us could be homeless, you know, so this is really a blessing to pass this out and to preach the word to the homeless. This is my wife, wonderful ideal. God gave her the blessings to... Uh, to have this vision. So i let my wife go ahead and take it on from here. <laughs> uh, one of the things about uh, us here at Jesus is the answer, one of the things about myself as a, uh, a man of God and a visionary, anytime somebody tells me they have a vision to do something, I push them and encourage them to do that because, uh, you know, an old wise man said the journey of a thousand miles begins with the first step. And if you never make the first step, you'll never grow into a massive corporation or a massive ministry. Amen. And this is a ministry of helps. And so many people in downtown Los Angeles get a lot of help. They get millions of dollars down there. They get all types of food. But there's no help in the outskirts of downtown Los Angeles. And that's where we're targeting today. We want to feed people. We want people to know the love of Jesus. That not only did he come to save you, not only did he come to heal you, but he came to feed you too. Because the Bible says Jesus fed the multitude. Sister Cherie, where do you get this inspiration from? What makes you want to do this type of ministry? You know, God put this on my heart since I was five years old. You know, I, believe it or not, I used to, as a kid, give away my clothes mm -hmm. and also food and things like that. I actually used to get in trouble because I would give away my school clothes and stuff. So God been putting all, this passion on my heart. Right. You know, so I know this is something, my calling, something that I'm supposed to do. So now, is this the first time you've ever done anything like this? No, I did it in Long Beach a lot. Okay, okay, yeah. Good, good. A lot. So how do you feel today, okay. and your first time you're doing it, and Jesus is the answer? I feel really good. I feel, you know, um, I just can't explain. It's just stirred up in me right here. 
and I feel uh, like this is what I'm supposed to do. Okay. Now, if you could say something to our audience out there, um, you know, that, that could help you, like we got Christmas coming up. What could you say to the people of God that are watching right now who might want to help? What do you need for to do this for Christmas? You know, for Christmas, it don't take much of anything. Um, you know, even if you don't have the turkeys, the dressing, just sandwiches, you know, just anything that you can give to the homeless people. And then also give them a, you know, an inspirational word. If you go meet a lot of those people, they're very nice, you know, and just give them an inspiration word to anything. Just give sodas, anything little bit that you have. Maybe put some money to the side and save it and go buy maybe once out of the month or something and give to the homeless people. And, and, and those of you, I just want to let them know, Sister Sheree and uh, Elder Elder Woodson, uh, Elder and Evangelist Woodson, amen, I just want everybody to know if you want to help, amen, if you want to help us for Christmas, we need donations of toys, we need toys, and any kind of toys, small toys, large toys, we want you to send toys, we need food, we need jackets, it's going gonna, it's gonna to be a cold winter, and we want to be able to give out jackets for Christmas, and let people know that they're from Jesus Christ. So we're asking you right now, if you have any donations of jackets, if you have donations of food, canned goods, and if you want to donate finances, if you want to donate finances, you can go on the website. The address is on your screen right now. And you can just give a donation by credit card of any amount, large or small. It will make a big difference because this Christmas, and especially with the economic crisis and people losing their jobs, there's going to be a lot of kids, amen, who won't be blessed for Christmas. And there's going to be a lot of adults who won't even have food for this Christmas. So we're asking you right now, amen, uh, Thanksgiving is just a few days away. So by the time this broadcast airs, you'll miss that. But you can help us help hundreds of people for, for Christmas. Help us. We need finances. You can go on the website and make a donation on your credit card or debit card. Or drop the food, the clothing. We need new jackets. We need toys, 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 toys. And you can drop them off at the church address that's on your screen right now. Drop the donations off and tell them that therefore Jesus is the answer. We're meeting right now at the Nehemiah Baptist Church. But we want you to drop those toys off at Nehemiah Baptist Church. The address is on your screen right now. And be sure to tell them these are contributions, amen, for the giveaway ministry for Jesus is the answer, amen, and the Woodsons. Yes. Jesus is the answer and the Woodsons because this is their heart and this is their ministry, amen. And so we just thank God for God putting this on your heart. We're getting ready to go out. Our cameras are going to follow so that, you know, we can document what we're doing and show the people of God that we're actually taking this food. We actually got these, someone bought these turkeys and three uh, turkeys were cooked, and we put them into these meals, and now we're going to go give them out to people who really deserve it. So don't forget now, amen, I want to, again, remind you, if you want to help, go on the website right now. It's on your screen right now. Go on there right now and, and scroll down and click Make a Donation. Amen. You can donate if you can give money. If you don't, don't want to give money, you have extra jackets, you have extra clothes that you want to donate. You can drop them off at our distribution center here at the church. And that address is on the screen right now. And also, we need food. We need turkeys. We need canned goods. We need, uh, uh, I mean, perishable and non-perishable items, milk, whatever you can give. Help us to help hundreds of families for this Christmas season. Amen. So remember that Jesus is the reason for this holiday season. So the last thing I want to do is I want to publicly thank you. Thank you so much for obeying God. And God laying this on your heart. Thank you so much, uh, Elder, 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 and Evangelist Woodson. Amen. Reminds me of my overseer, Evangelist Clara Woodson from Philadelphia, Pennsylvania. And one day, maybe we'll find out if you guys are related. Can I say one thing real quick? What my wife did not mention on uh, when you asked her a question about how did this come upon her heart when she was doing this uh, before, she was doing this on her own, and when she was telling. Uh, different people she wanted uh, that she wanted to do this nobody came out and helped so when she brought it up to Jesus is the answer this was the outcome where everybody came out like yes let's do this together you know at before it was just her going out there now it's like the whole church is, is coming together ready to uh, lift up the name of the Lord I will walk Long Beach by myself and take a bag on my own uh -huh. and just go up to the different people and pass off food and say a little word to but them. isn't it great when we all band together because there's unity, and unity there's strength. And the Bible says two are better than one. 
So we're doing this as a family. We're doing this as a Jesus is the answer family. A lot of our saints, our assistant pastors here, amen, uh, uh, brothers and sisters are here. And I'm telling you, we're getting our car loads. We're getting ready to go. So come on and join us. We're going in the city of Compton, amen, to minister at least 100 dinners to folks. All right? Amen. Don't forget, log on to our website. Make a donation right now, amen, to help us for Christmas. Help us feed hundreds of families. We need jackets. We need toys. We need clothes. We need canned goods. And you can drop them off. The ad church address will be on throughout the screen. I mean, throughout, on the screen throughout this broadcast. Amen. Let's go. Let's go out here Amen. and let's minister to the community. to break the yokes upon them, Lord God. I ask this right now, this strength, Lord, let me be prosperous, Lord God. Yet I will seek out about in your kingdom, Lord, Heavenly Father. I ask this right now, God, just bless him, Lord God. I ask this in Jesus' mighty name, we pray. Amen, amen, amen. What's the name of the name of the church? You ain't been a long time since I've been here. Come to you, brother, man. He would try to get me to join a church, but I never did. You mind coming? Okay. Yeah, All right, Okay, Yes. Thank you. Can we pray for you? Yes. Okay. Hey, how you doing, man? How you doing, my brother? Brother Henry, what's your name? James. Sir. James? Yes, sir. Uh, look at James. That name is in the Bible. Yes, it is. Yes. Lord, Heavenly Father, I just ask you to tell Brother James, Lord God. Head up, see, get 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 up, Yes, Lord God, I just ask you to touch his heart right now, God. Yes, Lord God, I both see he's seeking for knowledge, Lord God. He's seeking for truth, Lord God. And understanding, Lord Father, I just ask you to break that confusion, Lord God, that spirit of confusion, Lord God. Yes, Lord God, touch his heart, Lord God. Yes, Lord God, uh, put him on a new spirit, Lord God, a new church home, Lord God, so he can be renewed, Lord God. Renew that about she got about Santa Raba, she got about she got about Santa Raba. Yes, Lord God, just bless the work of his hands, Lord God. Yes, Lord God, destroy the yokes of the enemy. Me right now, Lord God. Lord, uh, you said, unless you find the strong man's house, Lord God, he shall be divided, he won't be divided against himself, Lord God. I bind the strong man right now in Jesus' mighty name, right? I rebuke the devourer right now for his sake, Lord God. I think this is right now, Lord Father. Anything, Lord Father, that's going to be him to do his calling, your will, Lord God, in his life right now, Lord Father. Lord Father, send him back, bring him back, Lord God. To his first level in the Father. Yes, Jesus. I ask you right now, touch Brother James. In Jesus' name we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Amen, sir. God bless you, brother. All right. Thank you. All right. They say I got they say I got nine light. Uh -huh. I say no I don't. Uh -huh. I got Jesus. Uh -huh. My friends they help me when I drunk an eight ounce bottle of piss and pit. When I swallowed a 48 down rock, uh -huh. when that police shot me uh -huh. all up and uh -huh. left me for dead, left my shirt up. Uh -huh. Being ran over by a car. It wasn't my friend, it was that man upstairs. That's right. It was Jesus Christ that That's saved right. me, That's God. Right, That's okay, right. Okay, you can pray Come for on. me, That's I'm right. gonna pray for you too. Come on. Let's pray. Let's pray. Okay, I'm gonna pray for y'all first. I'm gonna pray for y'all first, though. I'm real with it. Come here, my brother. Come here, come here. 
Heavenly Father. Come here, come here, come here. See how y'all do it. <laughs> you get in here too, Father. Grab hold of that. Shit, I want some of this love. Heavenly Father, come to you right now, Father God. Oh, he's going to pray. And I ask you right now, Father God, what is going on in our life right now, Father God? You know and they know, Father God. Ask you right now, trust you from the top of their head to the bottom of their feet, oh Lord. Father God, I've been pronounced dead four times, Father God. It wasn't nobody out there but you, Lord. You the one that saved me, Father God. Whatever is going on in your life right now, tuberculosis, cancer, to whatever it is, whatever it is, Father God, you know and they know, Father God. Cancer, whatever it is, Father God, you know, and they know, Father, I should right now, Father, stick your hand down right now and touch it while we're in the circle right now, Father God. You say when two or three come together, Father God, you in the midst, Father God, and we're right here right now, and my name is Cecil. I've been for now, David. Whatever you done for me, Father, I ask you to reach out and touch these brothers that's doing your job, Father God. I ask you to just heal us right now in the name of Jesus, Father God. Oh, I said, I'm like, right now, can we all just say, Amen? Amen. All right. Man, I know. You going, okay, now you don't pray for me? All right. I think I said enough. <laughs> That's no way. Right. That's it. But you got to come to the church and say your testimony. Okay, whatever. All right. You got I need my testimony right time, now. Man. We no, we can't oh, do it now. We don't have no. Yeah, we don't hey, have look. no. All that there, the gangs out there in the street. Okay? You got in on that? All the gangs in the street. We selling down the wall, man. Selling pop. Well, this happened. I should have been letting somebody move with me. They were smoking a lot, so man, okay. Uh, that like took away from me selling my gun, getting rid of everything in my house. I'm a G, but damn, this is what happened to me. So mm -hmm. we had to go. still here. But now you got me in this addiction on this. Now you got me robbing. And you yeah. should come on, let the Lord use Her you. To son, I just need yeah. you to like zip it. Oh, huh. oh watch out now. And that's how it is, partner. I shoot up here. Now I'm smoking Sherman. Sell it. I smoke on Sherman. I smoke on Rock. Lovely. Then now I get shot up by the police. I've been pronounced dead four times. I got some testimony to tell y'all. Each person I raised up in church. And that's how my heart is. But I got hooked up with that was going on in the family. And I got with my my people that listen. I got my people out in the street doing something, and they know it wasn't me. Right, 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 right. I'm here to talk to you. I'm going to go to the doctor. I just got my camera I just got the phone. I'm going to go to the school. Yeah. <laughs> 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 Not yet. We're about to do it right now. Oh, 
Yeah. Well, yeah, you thought we were praying for the rock, but he's about to get right now. Oh, okay, okay. We can take it for later, I guess. <laughs> Father, in the mighty name of Jesus, Father, we ask you right now, Father, to watch over him as he go forth right now, Father, and shut down the enemy, shut down the enemy, shut down every attack of the enemy right now, Father, cover him in your precious blood, put your angels around him right now, in Jesus' name, and open up his heart to receive your word, Father, in Jesus' name, amen, 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 amen. amen. all right, y'all have a good Thanksgiving. All right. Shift his life, God. Put him where you want him to be, Father. In Jesus' name, Lord. Amen and amen. 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 We left your card already. Right, now, what have you been? Okay. All right, you can walk right down there. I know, right down there. Yeah, you know what? Every third, first and third Saturday, we give them food up here, too. Oh, yeah. Right. Free food every first and third Saturday. All right. All right. All right. You've been home cooked meal. All right. Yeah, they'd be mom, you, chicken, and all that. Yes, so sir. all of it free. You've been I baptized mean, in Jesus' name yet? Yes, sir. Did you get the Holy Ghost for giving us a speaking in tongues? Yeah, I have. All right. Well, what's, your, what's your name? Ron. Ron. My name is Brother Hill. Oh, I see what you brought up. Thank you. Yeah, seriously. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Lord, Heavenly Father. I just ask you to touch Brother Ronnie right now, Lord God. Lay it up, oh, seek it up, I shout up, oh, see it. Lord Father, bind the energy, Lord Father. I bind the yokes right now, Lord God. Yet up, oh, seek it up, oh, shout it up, I see it. Lord Father, I just ask you to mend his heart, Lord God. Lord Father, bless him with a home church, Lord Father. Lord Father, possibly, Lord Father, just sit him in our church, Lord God, so he can receive the gift you have for him, Lord God. Lord Father, his will be done over his life, Lord God. Let your will be done, Lord God. Not our mind, Lord Father, but your mind, Lord Heavenly Father. Say it the Lord, Lord God, Jesus. Hey, that boy, she got it up. I shout that up, I see him. Then, Lord God, I ask you to break the yokes of the enemy right now, Lord God. Lord Father, strengthen him, Lord God. Lord Father, bless him, Lord God. Lift him up, Lord Father. Yes, I got up. she got up. I see him. Restore, Lord God. Yeah, that boy, she got up. I see her up. Say it up, I see him. Bless, Lord God. I just ask you right now, Lord Father. Lord Father, I just ask you to guide his steps, Lord God. Lord Father, just break him, Lord God. Break him, Lord Father. Break him. Lord Father, up, see, break the enemy, break the yokes right now in Jesus' name. I don't she got up by Sata. In the name of Jesus, I just ask you this right now, Lord Father. I just ask you to release a new anointing in this life, Lord God. Lord Father, let it get it healed, Lord Father. Jesus is the answer, church, Lord God. Let it be a blessed day for him, Lord God, when he come, Lord God. When he come to your kingdom, Lord God. In Jesus' name, we pray. Amen, amen, amen. Church, right? They didn't give me a card. I know where it is. I got yeah. this now. Yeah, right down the street. Me. I better run it for me. I'll find it. All right. That's the reason. Amen. Amen. God bless you. Take that. man. I know, I've been around. All right. Oh, uh, is that right? So, so you do for a visit. Come on down to see it. We start at 3 o'clock. Is that right? Yeah, we'll give you one of Just got off work? Yeah. Uh, where you work at? Jordan. At Jordan's? Oh, wow. They got the burger. You cook over there? So, so you can come cook and help us with this. Yeah. I remember back when we was hanging out there when the owner got killed. Years ago, right? Let me, let's pray. All right. So, Father, we thank you, Lord, for your mercy and grace and kindness. We thank you for your love and your blessing, God. We ask you to bless this, our Father. 
Do you keep him and use him? Did you fill him with the Holy Ghost and give him this speaking in tongues? Bring him down to the church. Amen. 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 Well, how long have you been working with Jordan? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Yes, no God, 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 him right now in Jesus' mighty name. God, I see a blessing right now. Bless him in the congregation. Bless his hands, oh God. Bless his children, oh my Father. He's looking after him, oh God. I ask you to strengthen him, lift him up, oh God, in the ministry, oh God. Yes, oh God, I'm also taking him following his call, oh God. Your will be done over his life, oh God. I pray the blood of Jesus over him right now in the name of Jesus, oh God. I ask you to touch him, oh God. Yes, I will shout to you, Rabbi. I see God, I'm going to shout to you. You married? Y'all say you got a wife. Praise the Lord, this is Bishop Ernest Johnson inviting you to come to a miracle move of God this Sunday morning at the Jesus is the Answer Apostolic Church. We're located at 25100 South Normandy Avenue in Harbor City, California. Come on out if you need healing, you need deliverance, you need to be saved, you need to be baptized in Jesus' name, filled with the Holy Ghost. I want to invite you to come on out to the Jesus is the Answer Apostolic Church, 25100 South Normandy Avenue in Harbor City, California. Join us this Sunday morning at 11 a.m. and Bible study is Tuesday at 7.30 p.m. Come on out and we'll see you there. Are you ready? Yes. Lift, lift those hands. Are you ready? Yes, Jesus. 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 Y